It's a testament of the determined. That on a cold February morning in Iowa, more than 1,600 people would lace up their walking shoes in search of a way to conquer childhood cancer. I set a goal for this event of $60,000 and our volunteers in Des Moines begged me to lower it to $40,000 that they just thought, you know, it's a tough economy, we can't do this, Forty dollars is our, our max. Natalie Cole is with the foundation called Cure Search. Cure Search raises funds for the Children's Oncology Group which treats about 90% of all the kids diagnosed in the country. Kids like Reagan Holsey, Will Kruger, who were both diagnosed with cancer early in life. My son's Will, he, when he was diagnosed in February of last year, he was uh, four years old. And, uh, you know, that's really the, probably the worst day of our lives. You know, I mean, it was very devastating to hear that news. It's a feeling that far too many in this West Des Moines mall can relate to. That's why friends, family, even complete strangers join the Krugers, the Holsings, and dozens of other families affected by childhood cancer. I am totally overwhelmed with emotion. Um, that I'm talking to you right now without crying is a miracle. The outpouring of our community has been outstanding, and it's all for these little kids. Overwhelmed not only by the number of participants, but by the amount of money raised for Cure Search. You raised $110,800. walkers. $110,000 raised, and nearly all of it will be used to benefit patients just like Reagan and Will. Research that will hopefully provide not just a cure, but peace of mind for these children and all who support them. Uh, just a lot of things that are really hard to, um, to see your child go through. And for, for us, uh, you know, this walk, and it's not just about curing cancer, but it's also about um, you know, the, the side effects of cancer and, and the quality of life that these kids will lead.